how's it going everybody i'll bring you back with another video on spider-man so hope you guys are excited just a heads up i know i haven't finished the other two games but i will i actually will in due time and let's get started wow i was wondering what this place was he just jumps down. Like if he's not Spider Man or in a Spider Man suit. That's Emily's tree. This is perfect. Damn. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. <laughs> Let him cook. And it's actually pretty cool. Jesus. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. <sighs> you know seeing you boys together again <laughs> right then <laughs> have fun get your badge out let's go exploring <laughs> so the first thing i want to show you is downstairs harry this place right Amazing. Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. Damn. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Oh. Wait, are you serious? I have data does not cross-tabulate with the AI learning we left in the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Yes. <laughs> you must be Peter. It's so nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Those aren't just... Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Oversized Harry bees, are they? Like robot bees? bees? Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, a carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Mini game time. Oh, Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to detect and attack bee wolves. <laughs> AKA bee and you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. When you see those little holographic bee wolves, the better you are at shooting them, the better our drones get at collecting the same target. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, I am amazing. Look at this. You're done with your, a very productive session. We got great data. Okay, why no? Yeah. Bro, that was easy. Like if I don't play first person shooters all the time. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Damn. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. Hasta luego, Dr. Young. so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. That was pretty cool. Boy. No, the numbers 
You have now, a sec? up ahead is the medical research unit. Eesh. We're doing cutting edge proton beam work. Using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. What is this? Oh, I can't even move. Ah. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Oh. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. Shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, That's listen, pretty cool. I gotta go make a call, <clears throat> but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Gotta call Miles. <clears throat> that was the deepest voice I've ever had. So that was crazy. All right, turn to call Miles. Working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Ooh. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Mm -hmm. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Right. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Ooh, I can run. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. Oh, we know what that is, right? That is venom. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Let's start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Hmm. Which it will. Think this through before signing on. Yeah. Hey. Whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. What about Miles, bro? Is he sick? You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Simba's gonna be the Flash. Where are we you heading now? Zap by lightning. Top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Damn. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Jesus. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Almost. No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. It's so calming, and we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. I like the guy right there. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for understanding. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. 
Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Yeah, hold on. So match. Interesting. ready to try the real thing this is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions corporations patent gmo seeds for profit and are rightly criticized but ours are open source developed for sustainability instead of financial gain so smart oh yeah Success. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. That ain't it. Remove that. Let's see. Beautiful work, Peter. We did it. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Everybody trying to butter him up Thank to you get him to join in. <laughs> so now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Oh. Harry, now remember. The things oh. you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working pretty on. Pretty cool. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on. Where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. No. -uh. I really think we need more. Wow. Dang. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But 
There's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. This dude. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, I was like, what? Oh, one quick thing. <laughs> I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. That dude's happy as hell. <laughs> oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Wee! Hey, <laughs> sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? That's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Woo! Here we go. One of my favorite parts. Jesus. Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Safari oh, pirates. We were sure it was there. <sighs> Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Uh, glittering? Come on, man. Put your head in. What in the? That was fast. Arachnid, come on! Now have your boss with the main get this kind of tech. You could have just said I don't know. Though. Where'd your boss take Lee and guard it? Here. Oh yeah. That's not ominous at all. Give him the okay. So take a look around. Yeah, look around. What do we have here? There it is. Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, birdie. Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets Bro. old. Getting to oh, do uh. real science, though. For actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Whoa! Is that a railgun that actually works? Thing is shooting at me. And you 
you won't get away! Another one. Uh -huh. No, 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 no! Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? Oh, what the? I'll take that as a no. Gotta start getting used to this. I wonder if ah, I can get is. my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. Come here. I'll knock you off. Bye bye. Please, she did. Now, That's for damn sure. Where's your boss? There's another robot. Maybe I can test something okay. out. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a. Yep. Oh, is that your home? Cut his hand. Let go. Come on. Stop my ticket for this ride. Wings. Wings. Oh, you know. I'm gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can take up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Ooh. Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, this buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta draw one of them away. Heard something. Finally, perch takedowns, bro. That's one. Yes, that's a. It's about time. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. Well, they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. That's, that's a lot of gear. It's like I'm prepping for war. Just knocked her out. And the spider has been seen in your area. Prepare the beast. Yes, Craven, at once. Craven, that's their leader? Where did he recruit you? Alaska. I track poachers for the parks, but when I. Anyone there? everyone now what are they up to hello surveillance video from the blind i was just at looks like they've got others all around the city 
I'll send this to Genki. But he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Yes, it's loaded. What do I do to Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. What's the hunt? Vent, take down. Hungry too? For me? You shouldn't have. Oh, oh sturdy and flexible. Hmm. Gonna make something out I of it. Wonder. <clears throat> nice. for a test drive surrounding bases are online remaining blind secured cloaking feels operational good beetles talent ammunition oh Russia. Hmm. still missing some shipments i'll have to pay that yard master a visit so these guys are better equipped than most armies this Craven guy must be rich. Uh, well connected. Or both. Or both. name does not deserve to be spoken i thought his youth would give him the advantage and he had lived there all his life knew the trails perfectly it makes sense his age is what did he need he got him here there it is again i'll fight this force I will fuck the source. No sign here. <laughs> Salah and take down all the words. Night night. All right. Where to next? Where to next, indeed. Looks like this is the only way. And yoink! A research lab? That's the Tiara Apitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal. Ugh. Martin Lee was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. An inner demon mask. 
Lee's old superpower gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Craven studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from. Or how to get them for himself. Huh. Dr. Farley Stillwell? <laughs> his genetic experiments gave Scorpion his abilities. Craven sure does his research. Literally. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? What's that made out of? We'll find Almost out right exact now. exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. Found it. Hey, MJ. I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. How about this? The name Craven wears. You know the story behind it? Didn't know there was one. There was some mine outside South. There was a man eater who'd killed close to a hundred workers. Craven was young, in his prime, and he tracked the lion easily. It took a few hours. Damn. But when he finally got close enough to draw his blade, the lion was stronger, faster, more cunning. And it was only through luck that he managed to strike a killing blow. And the sensation before that moment. I know it. Graven had never been so close before. So he took that name as a reminder. And like a bloodhound, he uses it to find a killer. Heard something. Checking on Just as much as the man. A true hunter. That was lucky. Oh, that was lucky. Any more fires must be light up in the city. As many as we need to. Ivan said they surrounded him in his dream. But if his dream is accurate, then the fires are fated to happen anyway. What is this? Why not wait for him? I will hit him. Yeah! <laughs> 
my lord. Super low health. I could really use some answers instead of questions right now. <laughs> that looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I kept bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt. That cat's a thief. I don't... Never gonna win best in show with that attitude! Oh, crap. Nice, doggy, kitty, robot. Ah, mash it. There you go. Got it. Oh, Lord. Those teeth are no joke. Heal. Roll over. Play dead. Control would show up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. Uppercut. Actually, now that you're here, question. What's Craven hunting? Maybe I can help! You won't live long enough to help anyone! Wanna bet? Listen! This would go a lot easier for everyone if someone just filled me in! Craven hunts what man fears most. That's all you need to know. Oh, so he's hunting failure? Intimacy? Clowns! It's clowns, isn't it? Good riddance, I say. Oh, crap. Keep the fight on the ground. Go back up. Or? What were you protecting? Scorpion, Martin Lee, Black Cat. This Craven guy's putting together quite the team. Like a scorpion, he lays in the sand.
Ooh. You killed him though, right? Did you kill him? He's not teaming up with supervillains for some hunt. There is prey. Felicia. He's not on the loose. Trust me. Where are you? Listo. For what? En serio. My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. Uh, can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. I see you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm sorry. Next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. Close it. a base belonging to those safari pirates or hunters as they call themselves and learned their boss's name Craven. and he killed scorpion and he's got a whole hit list of super villains wait what does this mean lee don't know but this list is extensive you need to find out where i'm going These must be the people marco warned us about they were hunting sandman no way Felicia's on their list too black cat your ex exactly she won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up, and... We're going to find Lee with us. I promise. Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? We're not, no, no, we're not doing that. All right, guys. Hope you guys all enjoyed this episode of Spider Man. So, let's catch you guys the next one. Our freak is out. Peace.